welcome back to our studio in, in Yorkshire. It's another another lovely sunny day here. Um, and today I'm going to share with you how I make some of my seasonal um, standing plaques. So this is my March one. You can see it comes out. You've got your lovely felt on. And the idea, it came from, I did the Christmas trees before Christmas and it came from that and I thought it would be nice not to put it away but to have a different a different design going through the year and I set off with great guns in January making snowdrops, love hearts in February, daffodils in March and then April happened and we all know what April was like and I ne just never got round to it so I'm going to play a little bit of catch up today and I'm going to do um, some of this, but uh, this bluebell design um, that I've worked on. So to create my design today I'm using what's called liquid stringer now this is powdered glass mixed with a CMC thickener medium that I've made up. Now I've done this in advance um, and mixed it all up and got it ready because whenever I'm working with powdered glass I need to wear a mask. And I think we've all seen enough masks at the moment, haven't we? Right, so let's get started. So I've got it in, in a you know little piping bag here so we're just going to carefully snip the end off and start work. You can see how I've got my design underneath and we're just careful, I have snipped quite enough there. You're always a bit careful because you can't put it back on once you've taken it off. There we are, so we're just following the design round. There we are. Now I'm not going to do all of it because obviously you can see it takes quite a little bit of time. But we will do another one of the flowers. We'll start with one of the flowers and again just like piping, just like icing. There we are, we'll fill that in. Let's te tease it into all the shapes. There we are. There we are. Now, I'd like, when I've finished it, to have a little bit of an impression that there's something more behind it. Give it a little bit of depth. So for that, I'm going to use this confetti glass, which is eggshell thin glass. Um, and I'm just going to put some small pieces just to give an impression of what's in the background. I've got a bit more forest going on behind there. There we are. And then we'll carefully pop the design on. And there we are. And then obviously that will have the rest of the design there. And that will go into the kiln and fire overnight. Now, doing this ahead of time. So um, by the time I post this video tomorrow morning, well, what will be tomorrow morning, these will be out of the kiln. So if you check out my page, you can also see the finished item. Um, while I'm here, I'm going to take the opportunity to do a few little sun catches as well, using some of this liquid stringer again. So again, check the page for those. Um, and thank you very much for watching. It's been lovely to see you again. Thank you very much. I hope to see you again soon. Bye.